The fact that he was able to make something of himself despite all of the obstacles that were in his way, despite all of the people saying, you're never going to make it in aviation. He didn't care. He wanted to, he wanted to do what he wanted to do, which was be in the flying world. And he made that happen. Colonel Walter Watson Jr. He was the first and only um, African-American crew member for the SR-71. I got to meet him and his wife, and he really spent you know, quality time talking to us about his life and his career in the Air Force. Getting to capture the stories of people like Walt, that's amazing. He told us about watching movies when he was a kid and learning so much about airplanes and doing model airplanes and just he was, he was so into it. And I think that's really cool because not everybody grows up knowing what they want to do, but he did. And he, he knew that he had to work hard to overcome his reading struggles. So the fact that he was able to do that and do so well in college is really amazing. And he's, he's such an inspiration to, to folks who come from uh, backgrounds where they have to overcome adversity, whether it be racial struggles or education struggles. He was able to overcome that. And he successfully became a commissioned officer in the Air Force. He started out in maintenance. And then he was able to, because he was so wanted to work with aviation, he was able to become a navigator. Even at the very, very beginning of his Air Force career, he was able to overcome the fact that he wasn't in the career field that he specifically set out to do, but he was able to make his way into that. And he did that through extreme perseverance and just working so hard to make his name known that he wanted to be in aviation. I would love to be able to live up to his legacy. I, I think that, you know, I'm an intelligence officer. I work with aviators all the time. So his legacy is just remarkable, and I, I would love to be able to live up to that in my, my Air Force career personally, but also just as a person, being a good person.